what's up everybody welcome to another seltzer review this is part two in the all new natural light seltzers this one is the aloha beaches when mango and peach go beach mode Oof, i am excited for this one after that cherry <laughs> lime i cannot wait to see how that peach and mango blend together because whew, that sounds amazing yep so if you watched the last video you'll know that one was delicious, the Catalina Lime Mixer, uh, but today we're doing this one, so make sure you stay tuned, because we're about to open up a can of this and let and you know what Go we to think. the beach. Beach. All right. That's what I said. We're going, we're going to the beach. Let's freaking roll that intro. <laughs> All right, guys, we are back with the Aloha Beaches from Natural Freaking Light. That's right, they joined the Seltzer game, and so far, y'all, they are killing it. <laughs> we just did the other one, the, uh, the cherry lime flavor one, and dude, it was freaking delicious, and I'm excited to try this one. It is peach and mango, which are two of my favorite drink flavors out there. Yeah, I. This is the one I've been wanting to try because I wasn't a, a cherry. I've never been a big cherry fan, but that last one for being a cherry lime was pretty good. Pretty good. And this one is the one I've been looking forward to because. Same here. Same oh, here. Mango and peach. It's got an awesome name. Aloha Beaches reminds me of you know chilling on the beach in Maui, in uh, Hawaii. Oof, let's see if it brings me back. Let's see if it does. Now, this is also coming in at 6%. How, the highest alcohol percentage in a seltzer is right here in the Natural Light Seltzers. If you guys know of any that surpass 6%, well, good luck and let us know. Only 133 calories, 4 grams of carbohydrates, 0 fat, 0 protein, 6% alcohol. All right, here we go. Let's open it up and let you all know what we think of the Aloha Beaches. Oh my Woo. goodness. That smells so good. Ooh, that peach <laughs> and mango smell just ooh, washes mm. over you. Take a sniff, guys. Just sniff, just sniff the, the screen. Go ahead, put your nose to it. All right, I'm, mm. I'm pouring this in smell a glass it. so I can get full all right. on flavor. All right, let's We're jumping here. in. It's all gone from the last time. Aloha Beaches from the all new Natural Light Seltzers. Remember, you can pick these up in 12 packs and 24 packs, and I highly suggest you get a 12 pack of each. I gotta make sure I got it all in the class. <laughs> <laughs> all right, guys, here it is Natural Light Aloha Beaches oh. Seltzer Peach and Mango. Sorry, that's. Oof. Are you ready? Here it is, guys. First here on so YouTube. <laughs> the first reviews, the best reviews. Freaking bugs. Right here. It's in summer, man, so. Alright. <laughs> here we go. Bottoms up. Let's do it. Wow, that's good. That is a great mix of peach and mango. I mean, you get both, I got both flavors. I got some peach, then the mango, and they blended after you swallowed it, and it became a Aloha Beach. I, it, it's, I actually saw- It is refreshing. Chicks wearing that, that- Nothing. Oof, that second that taste just, just like- It's literally like using the beach metaphors, it's like a wave that's washing I can over feel you. the sand in my feet. Like, oof. The waves man. are crashing around me. It Look at those smells palm trees. amazing. It tastes amazing. Like it's not a heavy, heavy. Like the the smell yeah. would make you think it's just peach right in your face. It's but a it's, strong scent. It is a light peach and mango with just the right amount of carbonation and the. Whew. This, yeah, the carbonation. I, um, where while it is a pretty strong, strongly carbonated drink, well, it's, it's actually pretty easy to it's drink. Not even str that strongly carbonated compared to some. Like, yeah, compared to a lot, it's not. It's, but it does have carbonation. But it's for being that carb. Like when you first drink it, you get that. <laughs> but it's so easy to like drink and to just. Uh, and the flavor is just there, dude. 
Ooh. It's got a lot of flavor. And uh, for a seltzer, it's a lot of flavor. For a seltzer, and that was one thing for me that was turning me off to seltzers was the fact that they had no flavor. It was just like yeah. drinking sparkling water with a hint of flavor. I can, I couldn't do seltzers. Yeah, like a lot of seltzers, I, it was way too carbonated. It's like they just took a little drop of flavor it's and put it in there. And this is like this has flavor. This has body to it. I'm not trying to be like a homer or nothing, but. <laughs> Man, this is this is fucking good. <laughs> it's good, guys. I I am. This might be one of my new just regular drinks that I buy. Like I can drink these regularly. Yeah. And yeah. Uh -huh. forget about well, not forget about beer, but like, <laughs> I. Can, it's a good summer, <laughs> like sitting outside. Or sitting by the pool, or at a party, even. Or well, at the beach. parties. These are great. <laughs> this would be. These would be great party drinks to bring, because uh, they're just. They taste like a mixed drink. They taste like something that. As long as you're 21. Yeah, please, 21. You know, <laughs> guys, and then don't drive afterwards because trust me, I'm already feeling it. I already drank one of these cans. Uh, we just did the Catalina one, and uh, let me tell you what, you can feel it pretty quick. Cause six percent. And it's this easy to drink. You drink it that quick, guys, it'll hit you pretty hard. So make sure you don't drive after having too many of these. But uh, yeah. right now, guys, it's so good and refreshing. A lot of flavor. Now, the one the one small con I have is the fact that the alcohol flavor does come out quite a bit when you drink it. Um, See, I don't, I don't which get is, it as much. Which is fine. But, you know, a lot of the other ones that are like 4.5% because I had the Spike Seltzer ones, those you couldn't even tell they had alcohol in it, which was kind of scary. Well, when, but these yeah, you can definitely when taste you get it. To six percent, you're you're gonna be yeah six percent, like I said. So it's up there, and you're gonna you're gonna definitely taste but it. I I don't get the like me personally. I don't get the alcohol flavor as much. It's good aftertaste. I get more of the, the peach, the, the mango. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then yeah, there's that subtle, subtle light alcohol. Don't get me wrong, it's, but, it doesn't put the drink off, the, like, yeah. like the flavor, because the flavor is very prevalent and you get a lot of flavor, but like, like I said, the aftertaste, you still get uh, that good alcohol type of it, like you know you're drinking something that has alcohol in it. Um, unlike the Spike, or the Bonnet and Viv Spike Seltzers I did, I remember if you, if you guys watched those videos, you'll know that I, I said that and you couldn't taste it had alcohol in it. This one, you definitely know it has alcohol in it, but it's so good that is worth drinking. Like, I like the Pacers that were 2%. You can tell those had anything. Yeah, the Pacers, but those were 2% as well. So you could drink like five of those. Yeah. Or like, <laughs> just that water. You gotta drink three of them just to get the same percentage <laughs> that one of these has. But once again, this is the Aloha Beaches from Natural Light, brand new, just hit the shelves. Um, and you can pick them up pretty much everywhere. You shouldn't, you shouldn't miss it because we have displays everywhere of this stuff and uh, a great price point at all the stores, so go pick them up. 12 packs, 24 packs, grab a, grab some, bring it to your party, bring it to whatever it is you're doing. Football's kicking off, bring it to your football party, tailgate party, because this is definitely a delicious drink. Yeah, I'd give it a, a 10. Give it a 10, <laughs> wow. 9.5. 9.5, I'm Just going with the nine once it's again. Still, still seltzer, but yeah, I don't know. I like that one so much that it's exciting, guys. The seltzer yeah. game has definitely been upped up a notch right here with natural light yeah, stepping you, into the seltzer if you're, game. If you're wary of the natural light name, I know some people would be, but at don't. least where we're at around yeah. here, natural light's not as big. Like it is yeah. towards the eastern part of the, of the United States. We're over here on the west coast in Oregon, and natural light's not a big, a big deal over here. But yeah. I've heard over towards like the mid eastern states, um, like past Wisconsin in that direction, natural light is pretty big over there. Yeah. But uh, over here, it's not really that big of a deal. But I but think yeah, this is going to put them on the map. If you just have that that slight hindrance to the the name branding. Give it a shot anyway because this stuff is definitely worth it. Right there, natural light seltzer, Aloha Beaches. Guys, peach mango tastes delicious, has a ton of flavor. 6%, you can't go wrong with that. So go pick some up today. Let us know down below if you tried it. 
And uh, if you're going to try it, what's your favorite one? Yeah. Well, we, we yeah. drank both of ours, so <laughs> that's it for this review, guys. I couldn't keep that. that. The Aloha Beach is in my cup. Heck no. They were delicious. <laughs> so thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure you are subscribed and leave a like on the video. Um, like I said, comment down below which one of these two seltzers are your favorite ones. Aloha Beaches. Aloha Beaches is definitely <laughs> top of the list. But don't get me wrong, the Catalina Lime, the Cherry Catalina Lime was delicious. Um, it de they definitely kicked it out of the park with that cherry lime flavor. And I really haven't seen any other flavors like that out there. So go pick it up. Remember, it's 6% alcohol, the highest ABV of all the seltzers that you can find. And uh, yeah, guys. Yeah, don't they're, they're drink good. and drive. They're and good. Don't drink and drive. Wait till 21. Thank you. Exactly. Like and subscribe. Definitely. And we will see you next time.